All right. So we're going to be going after this cave to hopefully get a bit of an edge. And uh, hopefully get the next somber stone, if it's a normal smithing stone. Uh, that kind of sucks, but I'm hoping that's going to be a somber. So that way we can go ahead and get our weapons upgraded. Because I'm guessing that these later areas are probably going to have the sombers, whereas the earlier areas probably have the... Uh, Uh, smithing, like the standard smithing stones. So we'll uh, we'll see what happens. Shouldn't be too bad. All right, here we go. Wow, we just hacked a wolf in half. Uh, I also did a little bit of grinding off screen, just so that way it's not super annoying. Um, since we are probably pretty under leveled. Uh, so you can probably tell because health is up by a lot. Um,. So it was like a couple points into bigger, a point or two into mine. I think it was one, maybe two. Um, and then it was like mostly like intelligence and I think like one into dex, one into faith. So hopefully we're about where we should be. I think we're at 90. So hopefully that's good enough. Time for jumping. Okay, and here we are. Pop off of torrents. And down we go. It's probably going to be terrifying. Uh, considering the last one that we did was in Kaelid, and that one sucked. And, uh, the Atlas area has not been kind to us. But we'll, uh, we'll see what they have in store for us. I'm hoping that it just has, like, strong melee enemies, and not really... ...many, uh, ranged. That's sort of the bane of my existence, is <laughs> arranged. Rune Arc. So I have been told that the Rune Arcs activate your uh, Great Rune. So we have Radon's Great Rune on, so apparently that activates it. So that's how we get like the extra like stats and stuff. So that whole time that we had the other dudes, it just wasn't doing anything. Whoa, 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 chill, chill. Okay. Is there anything back here that makes this worth it? Cracked crystals? No, not really. Butterfly. I guess that was not worth going in there. Didn't expect pickle. And then giant sort. I'm not sure what that means, but sure. Why not? Get that smithing stone five. 
like how these caves are here so you can actually see like where these stones come from. Throw rocks at them. Something tells me that this is uh, just a normal enemy. Okay. That didn't work out like I was hoping it would. Please get into range, guy. Or just not. Okay, it seems like melee is gonna be the the way in this cave. This cave doesn't seem that bad so far. Does not seem that bad. Try a ranged battle. In short, to be wary of rushing in. What is... What? Um... Is there no way to cancel this? Okay, fully charge. Bink. Wait for him to shoot. Okay, now it's safe. Go out. Jesus Christ. Okay, charge up. Hey, we got him. I fucking hate myself. Look before you leap. Note. Look before you leap. Because now I probably have to fight that dude again. Because I... I doubt he's one of the enemies that don't respawn. Ah, uh, that sucks. That sucks. <sighs> this is so sad. Okay, well, let's go. Booyakasha. Yo, chill. You're gonna fight. Come fight. Didn't work. Chill, dude, chill. Oh, it actually stayed gone. Okay. Ha 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 ha. You thought you had me on that one.
Okay, let's go down here. Glintstone's Grap. I don't know what that little image was next to it. Maybe my inventory's full of that stuff, so I can't hold anymore. That would make sense. So I do kind of just stack up everything. Arsenal charm. What does that do? Greatly raises equipment load. I mean, there's really no reason not to equip that. Because the downside of putting those on is the equipment load and it taking a slot, I guess. But if it increases the equipment load, really all you're doing is just losing a slot for a medallion, which I'm not even using all of. Village. Well, that went pretty well. Okay, let's head down what is assumingly the correct path. Slug. We already at the boss fight? I mean, you normally these caves are pretty small. So I guess that's not anything, like, too crazy. Um... Go ahead and restore... Get the Mimic going, we'll sling some rocks, everything should be pretty okay. It's awful nice of them to wait for me to uh, get my Mimic out. Okay, apparently uh, Sword is the way to go on these guys. And Light Attacks. Or maybe they have different... Different defenses, it seems. Because that ring blade one went down fast, but this one's staying up. Let's go for the bow. That did not do much. Okay, fire is definitely the path. The mimic did more work on it than I did. There we go, Somber Stone 2. Which, if I'm not mistaken... Oh, we're just gonna teleport up. That is what we needed for the... Prince of Death. Still don't know if it's going to, uh... Eclipse... The Meteorite Staff? Kind of up in the air? Honestly, kind of doubtful. But, uh, we'll see what happens. Don't know how much of each thing we need. Offer oh, bell bearing. Purchase. Okay, there we go. We needed three for the Prince of Death. I need a level eight, which we're not even close to getting. For the uh, the sword, so hopefully we just find one somewhere. No, no, no. no, no. Okay, if you say so. Prince of Death. No, it just uses smithing stones, not somber. Really? So I did all of that for... I mean, I guess I'll probably need it eventually. But really, normal smithing stones. Huh. What is in here? Tr 
try attacking. Wait, isn't this the dung eater? Have you ever felt the curse? With your whole being, the pox upon life itself. Feared and despised by all. The reviled blessing. <laughs> Apparently not. You are but a lamb. A stranger to defilement. Ignorant of your own ignorance. You no longer interest me. I've been long without peace. No. You have felt the curse. I can smell it on you. Apparently my son was a brief respite to go and unshackle my corporal trapped in the sewer jail below the capital. I can ken the pox will truly be you. Go and unshackle trapped in I can kill in the pox. Oh, okay. Uh, let's, I want to look around and see if there's any more, like, caves that I'm missing. I don't even know what that is. Uh, because if I can get those somber stones, I'd like to get that staff upgraded. Um, that's not a cave. Let's see where you did, where you did that one. cave here you guys go for the rot balcony sure that seems like a good idea yes the rot balcony yes very good very good Okay, let's uh, I remember the first time coming through here. I was like, mm, yes death Is that a castle have I gone in there? I honestly can't remember Okay, here we go the next cave the gale tunnel Okay, this just does not look like it's going to be very hard. Um... Aha. Uh -huh. Somber Stone 2. Okay, make sure we hit all of these. Village. Why is it always mushroom? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and rest. No reason not to. Time for samurai. No, it is not. Summoning pool functional. Sure, why not? Go for the sneaky sneak. I forgot that that only goes up or that goes like in a straight line. Okay, I was not expecting him to swing like that. Oh, what is that? Hmm, stay away from me. Village, smoldering butterfly. Not exactly what I wanted. Armament ahead, be wary of octopus, smithing stone four. Try ranged battle. Oh, 
there's a giant one. Oh! Good lord. Kill the little one. That's gonna be way too far. Oh no, we hit with that. Drink up. There we go, 1,600, that's what we wanted. Six, six, six. Charge up. Um, just shoot, just shoot, just shoot. There we go. Grab all these butterflies. Somber Stone 4, Cross Nagata. Smith Stone 4. I need Smith Stone 3, though. Come on, game, throw me a bone. Nice and quick. Another sneak attack. Shut up. Ah, oh, fuck. Heal up and grab all these cracked crystals. Smith Stone 4. So I guess this is the Smith Stone 4 cave. Gold pickled foul foot. Interesting. That is the one for extra XP, so that'll make things pretty nice later if I decide to go farming. alerting people. Did he even alert anyone? There's no one here. It's Miss Stone 4. Well, the Prince of Death, uh, once I get it past 3 where I need to level 4, I should be fine. Should be a-okay. Oh, here's the boss. There's a grace point down here? Right before the boss. That seems kind of shady. Smithstone 4. Okay, well, since we're fully healed up. Be wary of dragon. There's a full-on fucking dragon in here. What the fuck? Magma worm. I forgot to heal after I summoned the thing. 
Okay, let me get around it. Okay, this doesn't seem like it'll be that bad. This is probably meant for, like, much earlier. Go ahead and... Get my mana back up. Yeah, the Mimic going fucking crazy. Yeah, they love targeting the Mimic instead of me. Uh, makes this too easy. Nice. Dragon Heart and the Moon Veil. Okay, we're not going to leave just yet, though. We didn't get the uh, bell bearing, though. So we got a Dragon Heart. So I didn't get the thing I needed, or any of the stones I needed. Or anything that we needed, really. And now we're in Limgrave. Huh. Ain't that something. Okay. So that was... That cave... We still got the swamp here. We still need to find the needle somewhere in there. Um, is there any more caves I can explore? Does not appear so. Um, let's go ahead and give this dude this, uh, death rock that we found whenever we took out the ferryman. Whatever the fuck his name was. Bestial Sanctum. Oh, why, hello there. Take it. Bestial Sling. That like rock sling? Inventory, almost bolstering key, sort. It's an incantation. Lame. Uh, I could get the phalanx now, I think. I get meteorite. Okay. Um, bum bum bum. Yeah, isn't there a merchant? Maybe it was this one? Maybe the one in the swamp? I think they sell uh, smithing stones. Just a couple though. So let's see if we can just buy smithing stone three. Why, hello there. Trade again. Purchase. No, he only has two. Um, I also want to check. See, I could go up to better armor, but what if I hold on? What if I go up? Because that's like significantly better, like five and everything almost. So, what if I go to this and then boots? Well, now I basically just swapped stuff around for no reason. Okay, we're gonna go back. Instead, we'll go to the Crucible Pants. 
which kind of looks weird, but whatever. Um, we could probably also take the weight. No, not on the gauntlets. Okay, we'll go for XL gauntlets. Um, okay, so if he doesn't have it, we'll check with this guy. I think there's a few more merchants that we can check. Probably the one in Kaled. We check this one. Has have we even found any others? Da da da. Hello. Purchase. Only one and two. Yeah, sure. I'll buy this recipe book. No reason not to. I suppose. Um, let's check. Wait. Uh, Patches is here. Let's check with him. I doubt he's got Smithing Stone 3. But I also don't know if any of these other guys have it, so we might as well check. Okay, let's go check the merchant over here in Kaled. Which one was he at? Not the shack. Up here. Yes, the isolated merchant. We'll check with him. He probably won't have it either. So... We'll just have to deal with that. Purchase Inventory Sorceries Chest Legs Info Okay, so where is it? Okay, to the outer wall. Since we've been unable to find a merchant that sells the stones, we uh, will simply have to just continue going to every cave. So if this one doesn't have it, well, then we'll go to the cave that's a little bit to the left on the map. Which we'll probably go into that cave eventually anyway, but... Uh, if I can find what I'm looking for here, then... We'll probably just try and advance. Unless I just feel like going for the uh, next cave, because lol, why not? Okay, so it's below us. We gotta find a way down. Probably over there. Jump across and then scale down. So that's what we're gonna do. That is what we are going to do. Right on over. I still don't understand what those white footprint things are for. Probably some kind of enemy. Get 
guess we're about to find out. Is that a mushroom? Oh yeah. Big mushroom time. Okay, we're just gonna move past all of those guys and go into the cave. So considering that this one's an atlas, uh, I should be concerned, but considering that the last one we did in Atlas was pretty easy, I'm not that concerned about the difficulty on this. I don't anticipate it being that bad. Um... Big brain. Some of these places have been looking kind of sus. I'm glad I finally found a doorway that is actually a hidden doorway. There we go. That's what we wanted. The big yoink. Take all these cracked crystals for myself. And now I can keep all these crystals for myself. Okay, snag smithing stone 5. Okay, that doesn't bode well. I guess this is a later area, but there is no, like... I couldn't see any other caves, like, before this. Bell bearing two? Well, is two gonna have the level three in it? Is this the whole cave? No boss? Is there like a second secret door? There's no way that this is it. Oh. Okay. Let's go. Oh, okay. Can't teleport out of here. Despair ahead. Well, let's head out of here. This is a really short and easy cave. I ain't gonna complain though. I really ain't gonna complain. Okay, now we're outside. We should be free to teleport. Let us hope that this uh, bell bearing is going to give us the correct stones. I really don't want to have to search around for more of these. I mean, eventually I'm gonna need more because it's gonna go to higher levels, but... Offer bell bearing, level two, purchase, yes. Okay, let's go strengthen. Then hopefully it's going to require fours. Because I'm pretty sure I've got fours. Well, I took you no man to lay out your arm. Yes, lay out my arms. Carrion Glintstone. Boost Carrion Sword Sorcery. Boost the Sorcery Scaling. Yes, now we go to level 4. Uh, we need 3 more. And then it'll probably require 5s, which... I think I have fives? I, I know we just grabbed a couple. Hoping I have enough to just get through all the fives. And then we'll need sixes. Sixes. Um. Could this be a weak foe? I suppose it could be. It, it, it very well could be a weak foe.
Okay. Yes, I am back. Strengthen. Yes, now we're on to five and I have 15 of these. So now we're on to six, but I only have one. Damn it, plus 16. Sheesh. Uh, equipment. So how do these scale against each other? 193 to 187. So the Prince of Death is almost caught up. 